Discussions are underway for Something in the Water 2024. Virginia Beach City Committee members are talking about when the multi-million dollar festival will return and what improvements could be made. Emily Harrison has the latest from the oceanfront. Nothing is set in stone just yet, but a spokeswoman with the Resort Advisory Committee says they are looking to improve ways for both festival goers and business owners. The date for Something in the Water 2024 is still up in the air. Members of the Resort Advisory Committee met on September 7th to try and answer this question. As the festival's creator, Pharrell Williams, previously said, he would like to see the dates shifted to avoid the April rains that canceled two days of the summer's festival. We just hope that it stays on a date where, it, where it's been. George Coderides, founder of the Atlantic Avenue Association, says the festival is an economic boom to the resort city. He says there are other areas city leaders should focus on right now, like the events fencing that surrounded the boardwalk for 14 blocks, which he says could have negatively impacted some of the business opportunities. It'll take time for things to kind of get tweaked to where more people benefit and less people feel the pinch. So hopefully as time goes by, things get better. Here on the boardwalk, past festival goers agreed. One festival rule limited the number of times people could exit and re-enter the festival grounds, which some say limited people from exploring the rest of the oceanfront. I noticed that this time they had more fencing, and a lot of people was complaining about that. Now, if they can kind of like go best of both worlds, it might work for the city and for the, the patrons that come along. And we're told the city has been getting feedback from internal stakeholders and also partners working on overall improvements. Once a date is announced for the festival's return, of course, we'll keep you updated here on 13 News Now.